Katie. Hi. I didn't see you at the after work slammer. Yeah, I didn't make it. Maybe you should think about uh, loosening up. Ken, I don't, I don't think that's a good idea. I don't think it's a good idea either. I think that it's a policy. Stop. That's sexual harassment. No, you stop. Is it though? Notice the way Katie licked her lips when she was listening? Her subtle, slightly trampy body language? And don't even get me started on that top. Wait a minute, Regina. Aren't you sort of giving this guy a free pass? You shut your f***ing mouth. Here's the reality. Katie, no. Hi. What are you Thank doing? Thank you. What's this? Um, just a little work. Yeah, you're not doing the work that everybody talked about. Are you? Drink that. No, I'll... Have a, just a little drink. What's in that? I don't know. I don't either. If you don't believe me that most victims of sexual harassment are asking for it, then explain to me why you can't spell sexual harassment without sex or ass. We go throwing those words around. It's no surprise we find ourselves getting a lot of extra attention from men. If you're going to be asking for it anyways, lady, at least ask for a raise while you're at it. That has some self-respect. Hi, Katie. Hi. Hey. I wanted to tell you about this big project that I want you to get on. I'm not going to touch your dick, Ken. Well, then my dick will touch you. And that's final. Hey, are you an actor? Pretty cute. You know a lot about sexual harassment. Seems like you do. You're standing pretty close to me. You like that? You like the way I smell?